Jesus. Oh God, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you for being a God that sits high and a God that looketh low. God, God, we thank you. We magnify you, Jesus. Oh God, we bless your holy name on tonight, God. Oh God, we stand in expectation, God, of the move that's going to happen in this place on tonight, God. God, we stand in expectation, God, in the name of Jesus, God. Oh God, we stand with a receptive and a receptive spirit God in the name of Jesus God and we bind every spirit God that will come out against your word God that will keep your word from going forth God in the name of Jesus God oh God we thank you oh God and we bless you hallelujah oh God we love you we love you we love you we love you and we shout hallelujah <laughs> We shout hallelujah. <laughs> we shout glory to God. 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 <laughs> God, we shout glory to your name, God. We holler your name on tonight, God. We holler your name on tonight, God. For there's nobody like you, Jesus. <laughs> God, we holler your name, Jesus. God, we holler your name, Jesus. Oh, God, we thank you. Oh, God, we thank you. Oh, God, we thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, God, bless your people. <laughs> bless your people, God. Bless your people, God. Bless your people, God. Enlarge their territory, God. Enlarge their territory, God. Enlarge their territory, God. Enlarge their territory, God. Everywhere they feet tread, God, will be blessed, God, in the name of Jesus, God. And for that, we thank you. Wonderful is your name, Jesus. Hallelujah. Wonderful is your name, Jesus. Wonderful is your name, Jesus. And God, we bless you and we thank you. And then we all say hallelujah. 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 And it is so. Hallelujah. Come on, bless the Lord Zion. Come on, we can do better than that. Come on, bless the Lord Zion. Hallelujah. We thank the Lord for this day that he has made we will rejoice and be glad in it honor the lord for our chief apostle come on help me bless the lord for the man of god hallelujah to our national elect lady come on bless the lord for her hallelujah to every pastor every official we bless the lord for you per instruction from our chief apostle we're going to move on in jesus name praise team come on we're going to give god some praise real quick while we're waiting on our chief to come hallelujah we're going to bless him good. Anybody ready for a good time in the Lord? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, clap those sanctified hands one more time for me. Hallelujah. No sound? Hallelujah. All right, listen, we ain't always had music. You ready? Oh, magnify the Lord, for he is worthy to be praised. Oh, magnify the Lord, for he is worthy to be praised. One more time, say, oh, oh magnify the Lord, he's worthy. Oh, magnify the Lord. He's worthy. Oh, magnify the Lord. He is worthy to be praised. Oh, magnify the Lord. He's worthy. Oh, magnify the Lord. Is worthy. Oh, 
Oh, magnify the Lord. He's worthy. Oh, Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be the rock of my salvation. Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be the rock. Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be. Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be the rock. Oh, magnify. He's worthy. Say, oh, magnify the Lord. He's worthy to be praised. Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be the rock. Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be. Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be the rock of my salvation. Hosanna. Blessed be. Blessed be. Oh, Hosanna. 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 To the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Hosanna. Hosanna. We give you glory. We give you honor. We give you praise. Hosanna. 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 Oh, magnify the Lord. He's worthy. Magnify the Lord. He's worthy. Oh, if you call on Jesus, 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 if you call him like you need him. He will answer. Oh, he will answer prayer. If you call on Jesus, 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 oh, what's his name? 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 Healing in his name. Joy in his name. Salvation in his name. Deliverance in his name. It's all in his name. Come on and call his name. Come on and call his name. Come on and call his name. Oh, oh, Jesus, 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 Oh, what's it name? What's it name? What's it name? What's it name? Power. Power. Holy Ghost power. Holy Ghost power. Saving power. Healing power. Delivering power. Delivering power. 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 We need your power. We need your power. We need your 
power. We need your power. Got to have your power. We got to have your power. Say we need your power. We, we need your power. 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 Send it on down, Lord. Oh, Lord, that's all. Oh, send it on down, Lord. Oh, Lord. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord, everybody. Everybody resting on your feet for the entrance of our chief apostle. How he woke me up 
this morning. How oh, he's gonna be on my way, yes he did. And he gave me a diamond of a brand new day. Oh, I know, I know. Oh, I know, I know. Say, you don't know like I know. That's what it does. 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 Heal my body. Told me to run on. Heal my body. Told me to run on. Heal my body. Told me to run on. Said heal my body. Said heal my body. Said heal my body. Said heal my body. Told me to run on. Told me to run on. That's what he does. That's what he does. That's what he does. That's what he does. I get joy when I think about. I get joy when I think about. Oh, joy when I think about. I get joy when I think about. Come on, clap those. Come on, everybody, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Come on, tell him yes. Everybody. Yeah. Oh, Shabbat. Tell God yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Tell God yeah. Oh, tell God yeah. Tell him yes. Come on, Tyan. Yeah. Tell God yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on, I need every person. Tell God yeah. Oh, my, my. Tell God yeah. Now stretch your hand. Tell him yeah. Come on. Yeah. Come on, tell him yes. Everybody, yeah. Oh, tell God yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my Savior, tell God yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, my Savior, tell him yes. Hear the voice of the Lord. Savior, tell God, yeah, yeah. Woo! Oh, my Savior. Tell him, yes. I told you, he's looking for a yes. Yes. Oh, Yeah! 
rebuild me. Rebuild me. Revive me. Oh. Tell somebody next to you, the Lord is here, the Lord. Oh, you got to put it better than that. Said, hey, hey, hey. the Lord is here. Y'all got it, we're there. The prophet's going to get it this time. Hey, hey. Y'all got to be ready when you walk in here. You can Tell your neighbor I don't need a jump start. Just tell me to move. You ain't got to jump start me. Just tell me. I... He inhabited the praises of his people. I, I need to walk up there. Yeah. 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 Tell your name I've been beat up and I've been beat down. But watch me recover. Watch me bounce back. Watch. Ow! Ow! Bishop, it's been like this all day. And I know if it's been like this here, it was like that at Lifeline. And if it was like that at Lifeline, it was like that at Danville. Then it was like that at Sandersville, and it was like that in Alabama. Somebody give the Holy Ghost for this and say, turn me loose. our bishop he's anointed he's the pastor of lifeline but he's a member of cathedral of faith i want you to open your mouth and then i'm moving prophetically for our bishop bishop don harris Scott. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Come on, you can do better than that. Bless the name of Jesus. Oh, bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, I thank the Lord for my chief apostle. Come on, give the Lord some glory for the greatest chief apostle on this side of glory. Chief Apostle Bertie Xavier Rosie. <laughs> Hallelujah. Nobody like him. 
and we thank God for who he is. The house has been properly addressed, but I do honor the Lord for our national elect lady. In all her virtue and all her glory, thank the Lord for you and to my wife. Hallelujah, elect lady Beatrice Scott. To everybody in your respective places, I honor you. Hallelujah, I've been given instruction and I'm going to follow those instructions. Hallelujah, if you have your seats, I promise I won't be long. I'm expecting a word from the Lord. Somebody just say, I'm expecting some things to be restored. Come on, tell somebody else, say, I came to get what belongs to me. And that's why I came. Joel, the second chapter is where I want to go, if you will. Joel, chapter number two. Joel chapter number 2 just real briefly verse 22 says be not afraid ye beast of the fields for the pastors of the wilderness do spring for the tree beareth her fruit the fig tree and the vine do yield their strength be glad then ye children of Zion and rejoice in the Lord your God for he hath given you the former rain moderately and will cause to come down for you the rain the former rain and the latter rain in the first month and the floor shall be full of wheat and the fats shall overflow with wine and oil verse 25 says and i will restore to you the years that the locust has eaten the canker worm and the caterpillar and the palmer worm my great army which I sent among you and ye shall eat in plenty and be satisfied and praise the name of the Lord your God that he that hath dealt wondrously with you and my people shall never be ashamed and ye shall know that I am in the midst of Israel and that I am the Lord your God and none else and my people shall never be ashamed ashamed and this is the part i love because this is about to happen and it shall come to pass afterward that i will pour out my spirit upon all flesh <laughs> and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy your old men shall dream dreams your young men shall see visions and also upon the servants and the handmaids in those days will I pour out my spirit and I will show wonders in the heavens and in the earth blood and fire and pillars of smoke the sun shall be turned into darkness and the moon into blood before the great and terrible day of the Lord come and it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be delivered hallelujah for in Mount Zion and in Jerusalem shall be deliverance as the Lord hath said and in the remnant whom the Lord shall call. I just came tonight to remind you that there's a restoration coming. <laughs> now, for some strange reason, it seems like for a moment now, there's been a draining on us. For whatever reason it has been, it's been drained. It's like everybody wants to pull something from you. Everybody wants to grab something from you. Everybody needs, but at the end of the day, who is depositing anything? But everybody is coming to receive something of you. And in their coming to receive something of you, they come expecting. And the thing about it is you deliver. You deliver because you trust that God is going to supply. Oh, okay, I'm coming down your road now. He's going to supply that that you need. And every time you gave out, even though it seemed as if you yourself were at your wits end and you could do no more and, and you could take all you could possibly take. And somebody else came and asked something else or pulled something else. And once again, you poured out, you gave some more. And every time you had the opportunity, anytime it was requested of you, you did just that. You gave. Why? Because we believe the scripture that freely was given, so freely we receive, and so then therefore we are to then replenish those. But what about the leader that is constantly pouring out and is always being sucked from, is always being drawn from, is always being drained?
today I came to tell you that there's a restoration coming. God is going to restore everything to you that for years, he said, uh-huh, he said, I will restore to you the years. Years was the key point for me because some of us have been going through this for years. It seems like forever since we caught a break. It seems like forever since we've been able to breathe. It seems like forever since we've just been able to relax. I came to let you know today that your restoration is here. Today is the day that you shall be refilled. And he said that he's going to restore unto you the years. So if you can just sit back in your mind and simply remember all the things that you gave away. Oh no, hold on. Guess what? You can't remember because you did so much so often and for so long and for so many, you can't remember who all got what. But can I tell you something? God has not forgotten. You may have forgotten all that you gave out. You may have forgotten all that you did. You may have forgotten <laughs> all that you've been through because you've been through thing after thing after thing after thing after. <laughs> but tell somebody today is my day. Oh, come on. It's all right to be a little selfish. Tell somebody else, say, oh, neighbor, I love you, but today is my day to be restored. So I got some years worth of things that are about to be replenished. I came to let you know that your load is about to be lighter. Your path is about to be brighter. God is going to restore to you everything <laughs> that the canker worm, the palmer worm, the caterpillar, the locust, the deer, the ants, the rodents, that everything that snuck in and tried to steal from you. God is about to restore to you. Are you ready for your restoration? Oh, come on now, don't fool me. Are you ready for your restoration? See, what I love about God is he's the type of good God that always outdids himself. Now listen, he may have sustained you, but now he's about to overflow. Because, this, listen, sustenance is one thing. Sustenance will get you from one moment to the next moment. But I heard this one thing. Because, see, our chief apostle taught us something a while back. It said that he anointed my head with oil and my cup runneth over. Uh -huh. He anointed my head with oil and my cup runneth over. All I need you to do is stand there because the overflow has already begun to restore to you the dry places, to restore to you the desolate places, to fill you up in places that you felt like you were drained to replenish you in areas that you felt like you were finished God is now restoring your life and you thought you were good before I heard the scripture say earlier it said you thought that the former rain was something but guess what you're going to get the former and the latter that means that it was raining before but it's about to be a downpour now. Wait a minute, what's this? I hear in my ear, oh my God, I hear the sound of an abundance of rain. Get thee up, get you to a place that you're ready to receive all the overflow that the Lord 
is it? hold on hold on hold on hold on guess what this overflow is about to do for you there were some things that attached to you while you were kind of drained right that overflow is about to wash away the refuse that stuff that was holding on to you that you just couldn't that overflow is about to shake it off of you that stuff that had you about that overflow is about to ah, oh my god that overflow is about to overflow your life from the head to the sole of your feet god is about to completely restore and you'll be just as the woman with the issue of blood that's how you feel right you went this place you went that place and you got something but you didn't get everything well that's why the lord told the man of god that at four o'clock today a service would start because there's a sound of abundance of rain and that rain is to replenish oh my son the lord oh see it's to replenish all your dry places oh i came to tell you thirst no more thirst no more you don't have to be thirsty another day you don't have to be dry another day today is your day oh my god come on you're about to be rehydrated are you ready to receive it Come on, I need you to lift your hands if you're ready to receive it. God has it just for you. Because you honestly feel, you know you're saved. You know you're sanctified. You know you got the Holy Ghost with a mighty burning fire. But you just feel like you've been so stretched. And you just feel like you've been so tired. But today, tell somebody today. Come on, tell somebody right now. I'm about to receive my overflow. Come on, get your cups out. Get your buckets out. Get your things out. Get your toes out. Get your stuff together. Because the overflow. Come on, come on. The overflow is about to happen. You're going to have more than enough. Uh -huh. He created us in his image and in his likeness, right? You're going to have more than enough. He's El Shaddai. He's more than enough. You're going to have more. And so I came to let you know this, and I'm about to yield the mic to our chief apostle. You'll never be dry another day in your life. You'll never be desolate another day in your life. This restoration today is just for you. This refueling today is just for you. And this refueling that you're going to get today is what you need to get you through such a time as this. But guess what? This refueling will never run out. Why? Because now let me tell you this and I'm going to take my seat. I promise because I just heard this in my ear. You remember when Elisha was walking through as the Lord instructed him to do. The Lord told him, go, it's a, it's a famine in the land, but I prepared a widow to sustain you. And when he got there, he saw the widow and he said, hey, can you make me some bread? And she said, listen, I don't have nothing but enough for me and my son. We're going to eat and then we're going to die. That's what she said. She already had a plan. Elijah said, I got a better plan. I just need you to show back up at four o'clock today. And if you can just show back up at four o'clock today. And you give me some first. Then guess what will happen? You thought yesterday was going to be a booger bear. But today is going to begin the best days of your life. And from that point forward, it's just going to flow and flow it. Are you ready for the overflow? Come on, if you're ready for the overflow, say, Lord, I'm ready for the overflow. Come on, bless the name of Jesus. Lift those hands to the Lord. Father, we thank you for Bishop Scott. We thank you for his touch. We thank you for the word of God that's now in him. Restore to him everything 
but he has spoken on our lives that it goes to his life the boomerang effect happened right now enlarge his territory and bless him indeed in jesus name give god the best praise you can come on we can get everybody standing for 30 seconds if you can get our babies to get up hallelujah no don't don't wake him up he may go to cussing amen <laughs> Lift your hands. You. You. Purple rain, purple rain. <laughs> we can cut the cameras off because what I have to say. God bless you. Thank you all for tuning in. We love you. Amen. And that's why we advertise this service so that you would come. <laughs> But that's a word I don't believe is for the, the nation when I need to speak directly to you.